What's up, family? I seen this video on YouTube. It's funny about soul food. How um how black people we was tricked to cook this poison soul food. We turned soul food into poison, but really soul food is to heal you. I don't know why we start putting all these different chemicals and pig fats and all that and messed up oils in our soul food, but I don't cook it this way. But this this right here funny. It makes a lot of sense. Hold on. Dang. Who, who made the diabetes? You made me to be too sweet? Oh, no, it's just right. <laughs> he said, who made the diabetes? All that Kool-Aid with that hot corn fructose syrup and, and, and all that crap, them colors. Got to stay away from that Kool-Aid, man. If you want to drink, you know, make y'all some... Some lemonade, man, with some fresh squeezed lemons, some spring water, uh, sweeten it with some agave, you know what I mean? But that smell like cancer. I know that ain't cancer over there on the grill, boy. You don't want none of this. Oh, I'll be over there, let me get a plate. I got to give me one now. Uh, I got to give me one now. Uh, talk about that cancer. He said, pass me the high blood pressure. Me the high blood pressure. Me blood pressure on these acid <laughs> reflux. Uh, he called it high blood. Pass me high blood pressure. Got all that iodized salt, all that poison salt. You know what I mean? And you don't need that to season your food. And he called the greens acid reflex. Maybe people he called it that because people put all that pig fat and all that to give you acid reflex. But straight up greens don't give you that. Greens do a lot of healing for your body, man. And I'm gonna tell y'all how I make mine. After this video. So I heard you be cooking, boy. What, what you be cooking? <laughs> the other night, I made some inflammation, smothered erectile dysfunction, <laughs> with a side of depression. Yeah, now that sounds real good. That's I need some of that erectile dysfunction. Oh, it was good. Yeah. He called he called that that food they use all that poison, erectile dysfunction, dog. And he what he said, smother something. Uh Something, but he said he called it that because a lot of that food, that poison y'all using y'all food, that MSG, that high corn fructose syrup, and all that shit, that shit cause erectile dysfunction. Like that salt they call salt, a lot of that just be MSG, man. It ain't real salt. You know what I mean? That's the high, uh, that high corn. I mean that. Uh, what do you say, erectile dysfunction? So, uh, hey, Uncle Steve, that's no good. What's that? Oh, you don't know nothing about these damn gouts. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's what my daddy got. He said, Y'all know nothing about the, these damn gouts. <laughs> that's what my daddy got. He said, Y'all know nothing about these damn gouts. That's all that pig meat, man. All that, even meat, period. You know what I mean? I ain't going back to no meat, but all that sodium, all that high sodium in that meat, man, that shit caused gout, put inflammation into your into your um joints. Hey! You put your foot in these strokes, baby. <laughs> he said you put your uh, foot you in these strokes. You know hypertension. You sure that you hypertension? Is that good, good? Uh, hypertension. I'm trying, I'm trying. Man, all we got is these high cholesterols. <laughs> cholesterols. Yeah, yeah. Now, go ahead and heat it up and pour the juice back over top of it. It'll clog your arteries fast. <laughs> <laughs> I'm definitely taking some of the cardiac arrests and the obesities to go. <laughs> <laughs> now look, this the soul food I had cooked. You see, I got dressing, a meatloaf, yams. I, I'll play it. Ooh, dinner all done. Got me some sweet potato yams. Let me pause it. See my sweet potato yams, they're made with sweet potatoes, but instead of using all that high corn fructose syrup, all that domino sugar, and all that to sweeten it, I use agave and maple syrup to sweeten my yams. And then I put the, the um, cinnamon and, 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 and um, nut, uh, not nutmeg, all spice on there, and it tastes just like it. It's a sweetener, you know. Agave comes straight from a plant, or use um, 
organic cane brown sugar. You know what I mean? You, if you want to sweeten it. But I had maple syrup and um, agave. See my dressing right there? I don't use, um, I don't use, um, um, eggs and milk and all that. See, I don't know where we got tricked to use that, them eggs and milk and all that and our, um, dressing and our cornbread. Cause cornbread don't need that, man, to make. I use organic corn flour, organic stone corn flour. And I use the um a little organic um um organic um wheat flour. And and, and then I um to to make my cornbread, then I had used a can of um coconut milk, man. Use unsweetened coconut milk. It's thick just like buttermilk. And that's how you make your cornbread. I added a little um, aluminum-free baking powder and um, a little baking soda, a little sea salt, all-natural sea salt from the sea. And you don't need lots of that, man, where you ain't going to get high blood pressure and hypertension and all that. And then you make your cornbread. Bam. And then when your cornbread done, it be thick and fluffy without egg, without cow milk and all that pus. So you ain't getting all that inflammation in your um, system. You ain't getting gout and all that from this. See, this is real soul food, how it was designed to be from the creator. I don't know where our people got tricked to start using all them eggs and shit. Then you add your sage, your rosemary, all them is good herbs. Sage, rosemary, um, thyme, you know, stuff like that, man. Put your vegetables in it, your, your um, green peppers. Your onions and you know what I mean? Your uh, celery. Well, be the best dressing you ever had. Dressing, some mac. Hold on, I'm going too fast. See my mac? As vegan mac, I use coconut oil. I use my um, vegan slices. I cut up a few of them and melted that down in my coconut oil. And my vegan slices, I've been made a video about them. It shows y'all the back of it. I don't get all vegan slices, but the ones I get is made out of coconut oil instead of all that um, uh, canola oil and all that. I don't eat none of that. You know what I mean? And it is made out of good ingredients. I'm going to show y'all again the 365 brand. You know, and it, it's just like cheese. See, cheese ain't got to come from a cow. For y'all that had cheese, it ain't got to be from a cow. You could take any kind of milk. They use coconut milk and shit like that. Other than cow milk. You know what I mean? And they come out, taste the same way. Cheese, cow cheese wouldn't taste like that if you ain't add the flavors and stuff. But instead of adding flavors to, um, to, to, um, cow milk, they add flavors to coconut milk. And, 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 uh, and almond milk and shit like that. And my, my macaroni ain't got no oil in it and all that, you know, no extra oil. Like people be putting all type of oils and soups and they shit and all that and it be poison. And, and MSG, they, instead of salt, they use MSG. Well, I use some uh, sea salt. And you don't need that much. It's going to bring that flavor right out. You ain't got to be pouring like that nigga was pouring all that salt on the, the green. You got to pour that MSG and all that to taste that real life. And that shit caused cancer and gout and inflammation and erectile dysfunction. But not my macaroni. No, that's this ain't nothing but coconut milk. Cashew cream. I take cashews, soak them straight up cashews from the cashew tree. Soak them mugs and it make the thickest cream, man. You can make Alfredo sauce, all that. My my um uh, macaroni shells ain't those shells made out of all that poison flour. You know what I mean? It's made out of the um I forgot the name of that flour. But it ain't it ain't made out of all that poison flour. You know what I mean? It's made out of organic um wheat flour. You know what I mean? And you you know you get the right shells. It ain't got no egg egg in my shells. None of that stuff in my shells. My shells are vegan. And it tastes just the same. 
Man, yo, vegan meatloaf, baby. Better than real meat. That My vegan meatloaf is made out of the main ingredient in that is pea texture. Yeah, pea, pea protein texture is the main uh, ingredient in my um, meatloaf. Then I add all the rest of my stuff. You know what I mean? Now I use um, a packet of Beyond Sausage because Beyond Sausage have this stuff called methicellulose in it. Methicellulose is, is extracted out of seaweed. Now I don't, you know, I don't know if it's all good for you, but I know they use that to help you digest. Methicellulose been out a lot. Like when people who couldn't use the bathroom and stuff, they was using that so they can um they system could could um have regular bowel movements. You know what I mean? So you won't be all stopped up. But methicellulose is a thickener, and it thicken up your um it 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 thicken up your um it 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 get thick as it get warm. You know what I mean? So um. I use that um, I in my meatloaf. I ain't use all that salt and all that extra ass shit. You know what I mean? I use the vegetables. I put parsley in it. Onion. You know what I mean? Uh, pea texture. Onion powder. Sea salt. You know, stuff like that, man. The, the, the sauce at the top was the organic um, barbecue sauce. A little tomato paste. And um, a little organic ketchup without no high corn fructose syrup, all that. You know what I mean? And this don't give you no diabetes. You don't get no diabetes from that. You feel me? So that that's all good. There goes some gravy. You know, I made that up with the little um, organic wheat flour, mushrooms. I ain't even use no oil in it. Yeah, I ain't even use no oil in it. I don't, I don't, I don't do too much oil. I don't eat oil like that, man. Some mushroom gravy going. And some onions and spread. peppers in it. Got me some green. Greens, like they said, they give me some more of this acid reflex. No, I'm not my greens. Them just pure greens. I use the um little olive oil in it, and I put um sea salt, onion powder, and garlic powder. You know, um. And it's, that's about it. And clean water. See, I don't use sink water when I cook my greens. I use um, jug water, spring water. So, man, soul food ain't all poison like that. Beans. Oh, man. You make me a plate. Oh, it's finna go down. I mean, that's clean soul food. My sweet potato salad, th that's what I made with um, sweet potatoes. Onions, peppers, green onions. You know what I mean? I use this um, mayo by Follow. I think it's called Follow Your Heart. I don't know if it's Follow Your Heart. I forgot the name of it, but it's organic. Ain't no soy in it. Um, not no poison oil. I think they they use sunflower oil in it. It don't take all that. Ain't no egg yolk in it. None of that. You ain't got to have all that to good. Look at that meatloaf. It tastes better than all that beef meatloaf and all that, man. The, uh, sweet potato salad, my meatloaf. That that cranberry sauce, I get that from Whole Food. It ain't got no um jello in it, none of that. To, it, it gel up itself. We're using um I think natural pig tang. I don't know. I gotta look at the back, but it's vegan. Ain't no pork in it. It's only cranberries. You know what I mean? Come together, man. You don't need all that. If y'all read the back of that ocean spray, that shit got uh it ain't vegan because they use jello in it to make it thicken it up. And you don't need that. I don't know why they took that route to put all that poison in the food. My dressing with my mushroom gravy and good mac. Yeah. Yams, my greens, got me some cold Even water. Frank's and got the best hot sauce. Frank's hot sauce ain't nothing but five ingredients, bro. Ain't no poison in that. It's chilies. Is is chilies? Is um, is salt? You know what I mean. I don't know if it's sea salt or not, but but it say salt. Um, I don't think it's MSG. You know why? Because I don't feel no pain or nothing like that, and I and I don't eat that every day, no way. But 
I used to know when I used to eat MSG, my hands used to swell up, my head used to be dizzy. That's why I stopped eating that shit in 2015. You know what I mean? And I ain't felt that feeling no more. So Frank's, you know what I mean, ain't got no poison in it. It's onion powder, garlic powder, uh, paprika, um, chili peppers, and um, and salt. You know what I mean? From the world, Frank's. Uh, yeah, good soul food. So this video was just something for you to be mindful of um, what you eat, you know what I mean, what you put in your body. A lot of that, you know, a lot of that shit be poison in your, in your, in your system. And y'all got to watch out for um, a lot of the chemicals in that fake soul food. And it'll... It, uh, and it'll make people hate soul food because they be like, that junk was making me sick, you know, and, and it was giving me high blood pressure and all that. But nah, nah, that uh, that's real soul food. What I'm cooking right there is really for your soul. The ingredients in that'll help you feel better. Your hands not going to swell up. Your feet not going to swell up. And since I've been a vegan, I've been a vegan almost a year. And I don't have them problems, you know. Like I was, I was working out real hard, like a month ago or so, and I was on that treadmill and and on that bike, and my my foot had a little pain to it, man. And, and one day I, I took some turmeric and it took the pain right out my foot, like in seconds. I felt the relief right there, like damn, like my junk was hurting. It was because I was overworking my um. My joints, and, and man, that took the inflammation or whatever it was right out of my joint because I'm, you know, I ain't eating all that poison, dog. Y'all got to, man, watch what you eat, man. And soul food ain't no bad food. That's food from the creator, but our people start adding hog mogs, chitlins into it, and start putting um high corn fructose syrup and you know, all that shit, all that MSG, you know what I mean? And all that shit into your food, man. All that accent. Accent ain't nothing but MSG. It say, that's the ingredient, monosodium gluminate. That shit tear you up, man. And I, I know I'm feeling better, man. My life's getting better. I'm moving more, man. Losing weight. You know what I mean? I got to go buy new drawers now, man. I got to get a small, a size smaller, man, so I'm steady losing weight. And I don't even work out all the time. Imagine when I get on that serious workout. Like, I go through little spreads of working out, but I don't work out like that. And still losing weight. My appetite ain't as, you know, heavy as it used to be. Like, I ain't always got to have nothing to eat and like I used to be or niggas be eating chips and all that shit. I don't eat all that. I don't eat candy and all that, man. You know? So soul food ain't bad. That video funny, though. I'm going to share that video one more time, and I'm going to end this video. Dang. <laughs> who, who made the diabetes? <laughs> Is it too sweet? Oh, no, it's just right. <laughs> that smell like cancer. I know that cats over there on the grill, boy. <laughs> oh, I'll be over there. Let me get a plate. I got to give me one of them. I got to give me one of them. Yeah. Pass me the high blood pressure, bro. <laughs> ain't been no high blood pressure on these acid reflux. Uh, uh, uh. So I heard you be cooking, boy. What, what you be cooking? <laughs> the other night, I made some inflammation smothered erectile dysfunction with a side of depression. Yeah. yeah that sounds real good. That's I need some. People don't know that poison food cause depression, and them a lot of y'all depressed from the poison y'all eat. That erectile dysfunction. Oh, it was good. Oh, Uncle Steve, that's no good. What's that? Oh, you don't know nothing about these damn gouts. <laughs> oh yeah, that's my daddy got. Hey, hey, you put your foot in these strokes, baby. <laughs> I know I'm here by hypertension. You sure that you're hypertension? Is that good, good? Uh, I'm trying. I'm trying. You got more rolling?
Man, all we got is these high cholesterol. High cholesterol. Yeah, Look at that know. butter. Ugh. Now, go I, ahead. I don't eat, eat no butter. And pour the juice back over top of it. It'll clog your arteries faster. <laughs> I'm going to get up out of here. I'm definitely taking some of the cardiac restless and the obesities to go. They would die for.